Hey everyone, I am TH Pine and welcome back to Rollers of the Real. So firstly, good news, the developers sneaked in an update which uh, enabled language settings, so the game is completely in English now, great, <laughs> good job. <laughs> uh, that's good. Well, or whatever language you like, and set up in Steam. So um, let's continue our travel and uh, actually you will, I will show you now how, it, how the game works when you have multiple different characters and balls. Um, let's go to the shanty town, shall we? Well, I'm not sure if we use multiple balls here already. Besides beyond the gate. Oh yeah, we do. So, uh, this is one of those puzzle levels, isn't it? Yeah, we have to to go through here. It appears I will not fit uh, with the extra armor. You'll need to lead the way, my lady. Haha. Okay. So yeah, the, the knight doesn't fit through here, so we need a smaller ball. So with uh, I and W, I think. Yeah, with I and W, you can change the ball. So we use the the, the smaller lady here. Oh yeah, now we have to figure out how we get through that. Wait, do, what would we have? Uh, this and this. Probably want to get through there. Yeah. Oops. Pardon? There we go. Um, so, and here comes the, th the other mechanic. When you... Allow me to clear the way. Oh, he explains it now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, basically, if you uh, trap the flipper, uh, the ball in the flipper on one of the main flippers, it's only working on the on the two flippers in the middle of the screen. Um, you can press the character swap buttons as well. Uh, you can swap the ball mid-game, basically, which is very useful for um, for multiple scenarios, especially in those puzzles levels. Obviously, uh, the knight is way better at destroying objects, so it makes sense to swap that around. There we go. Another tight fit. After you. So, um, no. yeah, we have to switch again. Yeah, this level is obviously designed uh, for showing you those mechanics. So, she misfits through there. We have to... Uh, no, we have to... Oh, there we go. Please excuse us. We're just passing through. No worries, little thief. Your arrival is not unforeseen. Do you really wish to call on the town blacksmith? What? How would you know that? Word travels on the wind in this town. I will accompany anyone willing to stand up to the brute. I know much about the treatment of grievous wounds. Well, when you put it that way. Yay, another character. Defense average, it's the healer. Medium ball, melee, low damage, agility, medium maneuverability. Passive ability, parry, resist knockback. Passive ability, increase mana gather. So she gets more mana than other characters or balls. Passive ability, heal, restores flippers. Um, and she has an active ability actually, which is not shown here. Well, it's not really her active ability. Well, kind of. Uh, basically, if you lose a ball, um, like you, one of your character dies, she can revive him. And later, your flippers can take damage, and she heals them passively while, while collecting uh, mana. I think it was mana. Yeah, it's probably mana. So uh, where do we? I guess through there. There's a chest. Where's the key? Oh, the key is to the left. Okay. So yeah, we use the or I use the S and K buttons to move the ball around here like this. Try to get over there. And try to get the key. There we go. And no, 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 no. get over there. Oh. Reds and other vermin drain party mana mana. Yeah, that sucks. Those things will drain your mana, but it's not too big of a deal for this level. So we got a chest, we got a sidearm for the knight. Nice, uh, nice. Increased critical and parry ability. So, okay, let's get back over there again. Uh, how do we get in there anyway? Oh, I know. Uh, well, close. Ah, come on. No! I'm bad at flippers, uh, pinballs. Okay, I should wait. There we go. Ta-da! Yes, please. That was Shantytown. So yeah, let's take a look at the at the new item we got. <clears throat> so as you see, we can we um, unlock the healer here. Uh, we got the item from a knight here. It was that thing, sidearm. Yeah, those are those. Yeah, we unlocked these. Those for free. So we're just upgrading the stats this way, basically. Oh, our party is still level zero, so I'm still waiting for um, level one to. Why hire another ball or character I should say um, I'm not sure should I should I do two or one level per 
No, let's let's make short videos. Keep them short and fresh. So one level per day or per video, I should say, and one video per day probably around that. So um, yeah, next time we will go to the mean streets, and um, that was actually the Shanty Town is a two-part level, so that's fair anyway. Uh, thanks for watching. No, it's not. Never mind. It was only one level. What am What am I talking about? I'm talk I'm talking about yeah. Never mind. Forgot what I said. So one level per video and probably one video per day. That's it. <laughs> thanks all for watching. Have fun and see you next time.